Right now we want to check in with Tino Ramos who's near 71 where freeway was shut down for a couple of hours this morning. Tino, what's the latest on that situation? Yeah, you know, Karina, I want to get you updated too because the driver that was involved in the wrong way driver, he's in critical condition taken to Riverside Hospital here. That was the bad portion of this shutting down this highway here for about four or five hours. I want to show you our live pictures high above here too because you can see 71 northbound now back open. That's the good news for rush hour uh, drivers at this point. So, but this was a horrible crash that occurred just after one o'clock this morning. I want to show you some of the pictures from this crash because it was a southbound driver that was traveling near Weber on 70. It was a northbound lanes that he was in when he crashed into this UPS truck. The truck ended up veering off to the side of the road. One of the trailers to this truck tipped over, but the driver to the car was completely smashed. Rescue units had to cut him out. They cut the roof off in order to gain access to him. And at that point, rather, he was taken to Riverside Hospital, where again, he has life threatening injuries. Now, it took them about four or five hours to finally clean everything up here. They did have a slight fuel spill, but they were able to get that uh, up and running as well. So the good news right now, 71 is now back open just in time for rush hour. In North Columbus, Tino Ramos, 10 TV News.